hello everyone uh, welcome in my channel uh, wpf uh, so today i'm going to show you how to create a dynamically checkbox uh, from data database table so first of all add adio.net entity edmx file you can see so i have a branch table and uh, in which we have some branches like itcs elef and uh, i want to uh, show uh, the old branches in the form of the checkboxes so uh, the checkboxes actually uh, uh, created dynamically and each branch associated with the checkbox. So um, after that they successfully designed the EDMX file. You can pick the context file as well as uh, you pick the properties of the context uh, file. Uh, you can retrieve all the uh, branches uh, which is included in the branch table and uh, after that you can uh, after that you can create a dynamically checkbox and associate that uh, name of the branch to the checkboxes so it, it's easy to things to do can okay guys uh, it's easy to uh, create uh, so first of all add a stack panel control and after that you can add the stack panel control you can uh, uh, add uh, the checkboxes that is created dynamically uh, on the tech, uh, on the stack panel uh, with the name property of the stack panel is st1 so you can use a name property in the code behind file you can say the code file that st one dot children's dot add and what uh, the things you can add that is dynamically created checkbox so dot that is chk and uh, okay guys uh, you can do yourself uh, create a uh, first of all method okay uh, now uh, so uh, test entities is the context class so create a object that is context and by using this object you can retrieve the public properties that is branches uh, is automatically uh, uh, created with the name of the table you know in the entity framework so a uh, variable item context or branches dot to list for the each uh, list of item you can uh, create a text box sorry a checkbox so use a class that is checkbox chk equals to new checkbox and the collection is item list and uh, uh, create a, a object of the checkbox class so chk checkbox chk uh, equals to new checkbox okay new checkbox chk dot text oops it's not a text actually uh, it's a content so content equals to item dot name dot to string name actually uh, is the field uh, of the table you can say field in the table you can say so after that you can add the um, children in the stack panel so st1 dot children dot add chk that's fine you can run your file and uh, Keep watching my all other videos. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel. Don't forget this. So, guys, please, I request you, subscribe my channel. Thank you very much for watching this video. Yeah, it's uh, running successfully. CSITELEF. Thank you very much.